I'm gonna tell you straight what's- I'm gonna tell you straight up LA Lakers. I'm gonna tell you straight up LA Lakers. Nick Young, Swag P, D'Angelo Russell. Maybe if y'all weren't worrying about your little drama here with, uh, Iggy, uh, uh, whatever, whatever her goddamn last name is. If y'all weren't bringing that stuff into the locker room and stuff like that, you weren't, weren't not worried about Iggy Azuzuela, and you're worried about Andre Iggy Iggy Dalla in the Golden State Warriors, maybe your ass will be in the playoffs. Um, to start off this rant, guys, which I already have, I guess, basically what happened is Nick Young was uh, talking, man, having some bro talk with his bros, and uh, basically he was talking about uh, pretty much cheating on his fiance, uh, Iggy. I don't know where goddamn is. I'm her goddamn music, guys. I don't know where she is. I, I'm not mainstream like that. Um, and, and he, you know, he talked about going to, like, clubbing and stuff like that and hooking up and all that stuff. And um, D'Angelo Russell filmed the whole goddamn thing. And I'm going to say straight up, I'm not all about cheating, okay? I think cheating is one of the worst possible things you could do with somebody. But also, there is a bro code. You don't break that shit, man, okay? Like, you, you trust your bros... With, any, with with your life, with anything, man. Like you should be able to tell them something out there, and uh, not expect it to get leaked. That's just I don't know how it got leaked, man. Basically, you know, D'Angelo had to have been sending out to people, right? That's how stuff gets leaked. Um, which all which which also makes me concerned with uh, you know, I, I remember High School Musical, man. The the, the, one, the one hot chick, uh, Vanessa Hutchins. She was dating Zac Efron, and uh, you know, this was after High School Musical, man. He was they were dating, and uh, he he she she sent him out some nudes naked pictures and then things got leaked on the internet man so zach efron will be a goddamn unfaithful man okay to the uh you know to, to to the benefit of us out i'm just joking i'm just joking not really um but yeah guys so basically guys what i'm looking at here is who would win a fight between nick young and uh d'angelo russell because yo nick young wants to beat his ass now man he wants to beat his ass breaking the bro code and, uh, you know, who knows, man, this might, I don't know what their uh, relationship is with, uh, you know, Nick Young and, and Iggy, whatever that like, goddamn last name is, we're gonna call her Swaggy Iggy, Iggy Young, whatever her name is, um, this might end the relationship, maybe it's already in the, you know, hot water, anyway, I, I don't see Nick Young as the type of person to, uh, really hold a relationship for long term, being judgmental, but it's kind of, you know, just, just based off history of me knowing him as a player, man, um, but yeah, yo, so y'all see that Nick Young got 35 blocks, so, you know, if you, if D'Angelo's throwing punches, man, that 35 blocks not going to do nothing, man, he ain't going to be blocking much stuff out there, so he probably going to get wasted pretty quick there, he got 35 blocks compared to D'Angelo, they both got 35 blocks, so, in all reality, no player is going to be blocking, you know, punches and whatnot, um, both are going to be open for, you know, big hits and whatnot, next thing we got to look at, hustle, hustle, 65 D'Angelo Russell, Swaggy P, 66, so we got a little bit more in the hustle game, but still pretty much the same there, nothing too, um, different here, so, you know, they're both gonna be out there hustling, you know, throwing punches and stamina and all that stuff, looking at the speed, 72 speed to D'Angelo Russell, 83 speed, so D'Angelo Russell's definitely got the quickness out of him, man, all that stuff there, you know, jabbing punches and however it goes, man, you know, Muhammad Ali, whatever you want to say out there, so, um, you know, based on that so far, looking like D'Angelo Russell is definitely in the winning to win an actual, you know, street fight out there. Um, acceleration, vertical, yeah, yeah, strength. Very important, guys. 54 strength. So, D'Angelo Russell, hit up the goddamn weight room, man. You're pretty weak out there at 54 strength. Uh, Swaggy P only at 51, though. So, I mean, you know, Swaggy might be able to shoot the basketball, but he ain't going to be able to throw a tough punch. He can't really shoot the basketball anymore, either. I don't know why he's doing this in his picture, man. Um, it's gonna be, it's gonna be that and this, a KO, if you don't watch yourself pretty soon. Stamina 85, so, you know, he's gonna last pretty long. Um, apparently this Iggy trick is pretty hot, so, I mean, you know, when you, when you have a hot trick like that, you got definitely gotta keep your stamina up, if you know what I'm saying. So, 85 stamina's pretty good there. D'Angelo Russell, 88, though, so we got a little bit more stamina, so we must got a hotter girlfriend. Um, I, I think, I think I'm using stamina in the wrong context here. I'm not even relating to the basketball or boxing. So I'm gonna say about that. Uh, overall durability, this is still very important too, man. Durability, man. How long are you gonna be able to go without getting injured? Like, you know, if you get jacked in the face or something, you're gonna get up from that, or you're gonna cry about it. Man. You're gonna cry about it, get a you know punch in the nose, broken nose. You're gonna fight through. We got 82 durability for D'Angelo Russell. And Nick, Nick got some guys, so pretty uh, even there. So you look at these guys' physical attributes. They're six seven height, 210 pounds to uh, Russell's six five, not 195. Pretty similar, guys, in, in physical stature. Um, D'Angelo Russell definitely got the speed on him, which is ultimately going to be the underlying factor here. But also the age factor of Nick Young, and just uh, seemed like more of like a gangster, if you ask me. Like he just seems more like a he got like the craziness aspect to him too. I mean, um, you, you you see Nick Young shoot them three pointers and, and like turn around like he made it and he'll miss it or something like that. So he's not afraid to 
to take the swag shot out there, man. So he's going to be throwing haymakers. He's going to be doing some dirty stuff out there, whatever he needs to do to get the win. Where D'Angelo Russell is going to be more strategic about it. You know, use his speed to his advantage. Um, if you ask me, based off this situation, based off the broken bro code, if these two got in a fight, I got my money on Nick Young. I got, you know, I got my line, my money on him to win this fight because he also got the anger thing going, man. Like, D'Angelo Russell, bitch move by him. Um, not a good look for the Lakers at all. Like I said, don't worry about Iggy, whatever got down, like Iggy Young, and worry about uh, you know Andre Iguodala out there. And then you, maybe your team will be set. Maybe when maybe you want some games, make the playoffs. Thank you all so much for watching. Let me know who you think will win a fight between these two. Peace out, my friends.